So cataract refers to opacity in the lens of the eye. The lens is normally clear, um, but as cataract develops, it becomes less clear and it start, you start to look through effectively a filter. It's a yellowy filter that you're starting to look through and that degrades the quality of the image. So the commonest um, symptom is reduction in the sharpness of central vision, but it can also cause glare in sunshine or in low light. Um, it can cause problems with color vision and contrast sensitivity. Um, and um, these can be quite disabling. They can also be quite subtle. Um, so because that cataract surgery is now so successful, we often offer surgery at a much earlier stage than previously. It's not really known what causes the majority of cataracts. There may be a genetic element. Uh, it's thought perhaps that um, there are factors we're unaware of. Smoking is one of the few modifiable risk factors. So um, uh, that's one of the many reasons it's good not to smoke. In the developing world, it's thought that regular dehydration may cause a, um, a, a degree of cataract. But um, in the developed world in, in the West, um, it's, there's no point becoming extra hydrated to try and avoid cataracts. So the majority of cataracts form for reasons that we're completely unaware of. So cataract treatment is now dramatically successful. Um, the lens is dissolved within the eye through a tiny little incision. Um, and uh, we leave the coating of the natural lens to support the, the plastic lens that we put inside the eye, which corrects um, the vision. In addition to improving the symptoms of cataract, we're also able to correct long or short-sightedness and astigmatism by appropriate lens implantation in the eye. And we can also avoid the need for reading glasses in a number of uh, cases by appropriate selection of lens implants. Um, the surgery is extremely safe and effective. It's done under local anesthetic in the vast majority of cases. Rehabilitation, recovery of vision, very rapid. Uh, vision often better the next day, certainly within a week. And um, for example, driving can be resumed after a very short period of time indeed. Cataract surgery um, is performed under local anaesthetic in the vast majority of cases. It involves going into a sterile operating theatre, having had the full assessment in the outpatients with various measurements that allow calculation of the lens implant that's being, going to be um, implanted into the eye. Um, uh, you, you lie flat for about 15 or 20 minutes. Um, you hear sounds. Generally, um, anaesthesia is local, so either drops of anaesthetic or sometimes a small injection onto the surface of the eye, which numbs the eye. So no pain, a feeling of uh, pressure or, or a sensation of touching, but no discomfort. Um, the whole procedure lasts 15 or 20 minutes. Um, afterwards, um, uh, the drops can be started um, within a few hours and the vision recovers within a few days. Well, it can take uh, four weeks or so for the vision to fully recover, but the majority of the vision uh, recovers within one to two weeks. And sometimes the vision is better the next day. People are often amazed how well they can see having been affected gradually by the symptoms of cataract. Um, because this, the symptoms come on so gradually, it's often not appreciated quite how much the vision's affected. So people often are really, really pleased and very impressed and often very emotional the day after cataract surgery because things improve so quickly.